Hey, what is going on guys? How's everyone doing? Got a uh, Rhino and Amy in the chat. How are you doing guys? You're, you're okay? Right, so I put a poll out and Metroid Fusion 1. Now, I've got a bit of a history with this game. I used to play it so much when I was in high school, but I literally haven't touched it since then. So it's going to be interesting going through it and seeing what I remember. So before we go any further, let me know if the audio levels are okay. Right then. Let's get this started, guys. Like I said, um, I haven't played this in so long. Uh, but after playing Metroid Prime back in the day, um, I instantly wanted to pick up Metroid Fusion. And it is such a good Metroidvania title. One of the best, in my opinion. Alright, let's get into this story. Oh, I love these, uh, these cutscenes, man. They are so cool. I'm a sprite, man. Just as good as I remember it. Right, if you haven't already, guys, let's get this stream off to a good start. Everyone hit that like button. It really does help us out. If I remember rightly, this opening cutscene is quite long. Uh, there is quite a good story to this one. Hey, Paolo, how are you doing, man? Welcome to the stream, dude. Thanks for joining us. Have you ever played this game before, mate? Man, these sprites are so cool. I miss games like this, man. From a, from a simple era. Uh, this era is one of the greatest. Absolute masterpiece to me. Yeah, I totally agree, man. I think it's one of the best in the series. By far. I used to play it a lot when I was in high school, man. Um, but I've never gone back to it. Like So this is the first time I've played it in many years, man. So it's going to be interesting to see what I remember. Oh, hey, Rhino. How you doing, man? Uh, no worries, dude. Take your time, man. Man, this music. So retro. Right, guys, this is part of our random Wednesday stream. So every Wednesday, there's going to be a random stream. I'm going to put a poll out after this one ends. So if there's any suggestions on any games you'd like me to play, uh, just leave them in the chat and I will add them to the poll. We're going to be continuing our Final Fantasy VI playthrough on Sunday as well. So look forward to that as well. Uh, one game that was in the poll uh, for this week was Sword of the Berserk. I really wanted to play that. I love that game on the Dreamcast. Uh, so I, I might put that back in the poll as well for next week. <laughs> Man, this intro is fucking epic. <laughs> Uh, nice, I didn't know you were going to continue that playthrough. It is a long game, so I'm glad you're continuing it on Sunday. Yeah, man, uh, what I decided uh, when I first started streaming again, uh, that every Wednesday we're just going to do a random game. Uh, but Sunday will always be a continuous playthrough of one game. So once we complete Final Fantasy VI, um, I'll start another game that we continuously play through as well. So uh, any suggestions for that as well would be appreciated. Hey, Zeophobic, how you doing, man? Welcome to the stream, dude. Thanks for joining us. 
Have you played this game before, mate? <laughs> Amy, I'm not playing Sonic. <laughs> I refuse to play Sonic. If any, if anyone suggests Sonic, it won't be in the poll. I'm sorry, but I'm just not playing Sonic. That game gets me every time, man. Every time. Right then. Hopefully we'll get into gameplay soon. Just as I remembered, this, uh, this intro was quite long. Right, here we are, lads. Man, what a cool ship. Hey, Juan, how you doing? Welcome to the stream, dude. Uh, in one single day, we got Metroid Fusion and Metroid Prime. Uh, Metroid Prime. Metroid Prime. The good old times. Yeah, dude, I totally agree. Absolutely love Metroid Prime back in the day. And then obviously being, being able to play this on the go as well. Because obviously this, this harkens back to Super Metroid. Met Metroid Prime was such a different style of game. Obviously being first person and in 3D. Uh, but this really harkened back to the Super Nintendo era. And I think that plays in its favour. It's such a great game. <laughs> what? No Sonic? Not even Mania? <laughs> I don't know. I might play Mania. Just not Sonic 2. Sonic 2, I can't stand, man. That game gets me every time. Hey, Lucky June. How are you doing? Thanks for joining us, man. Uh, what's up, bro? Glad I made it. One of my favourite games. It is one of the greats, dude. I used to rinse this so much back in high school, man, so it's going to be good going through it. Hey, Dan K, how you doing, man? Thanks for joining us. Hey, Kitsune. Long time no see, dude. Thanks for joining us, man. Uh, yeah, I just like the so uh, 2D Sonics as well. I just don't get it. I, I don't... Man, Sonic 1 is alright, but Sonic 2, to me, is just so unforgiving, man. Uh, I, I grew up on Mario, so I think that's the problem. But Sonic 2, I just can't get on with, man. Uh, Sonic Mania is really good, though. Well, guys, let me know if the audio is okay. Uh, if you'd like the game a bit higher. Man, this looks so cool. The memories are just flooding back, man. Every day on the bus to school, I would just play this. This and Advance Wars. Though That was my jam, man. Metroid Fusion and Advance Wars. Uh, did you ever try Mummy Remastered? It's kind of like Metroid. Uh, no, I've never played that, Kitsune. What uh, console was that on, man? Hey, Griff, how you doing, man? Thanks for joining us, dude. Uh, audio's perfect. Alright, cheers, then. Oh. If I remember rightly, we need to go to the navigation room. Yeah, there we are. He's down the bottom. Uh, audio is 100% pip. Cheers, Paolo. Appreciate it, lads. If you haven't already, guys, please do leave a like. It does help us out. Uh, Ruby just said she's heard of this, by the way, James. Oh, is she? Yeah, this game is quite popular, Amy. Uh, you know, the Metroid series as a whole. Uh, there's meant to be a new one coming out, Metroid Prime 4, uh, which a lot of uh, people in the fandom are looking forward to. It's going to be nice to see what that game's all about. I'm surprised we haven't seen anything at Metroid Pr uh, Prime 4. Uh, but yeah, the two I, I much prefer the 2D uh, Metroids. Met Metroid Prime is, is awesome, don't get me wrong. Um, but there's just something about, uh, you know, that old school Metroidvania style of uh, exploration and combat. Oh god. Come here! No! Nice, we got him, lads. Alright, let's jump into that. Nice. So let's go back to the navigation room. Uh, hey, Say, how you doing, man? Welcome to the stream, dude. It's nice to see you again. Uh, Fusion was the game that got me into the series. Played it at a demo station at the Best Buy uh, and fell in love with it in only a few minutes. Yeah, dude, it's so, it's just so intoxicating. Like the atmosphere, the graphics, the gameplay. It just all comes together to create something just truly special. It's just amazing. I wish they would create like another 2D Metroid. To be honest, uh, I just looked at the Mummy de uh, Demastered. Holy crap, that looks like an awesome Metroid style game. Oh, right, yeah, cheers, uh, Kitsune. I'll have to check that out, man. Uh, 
Hey Ian, thanks for joining us dude. How you doing? Uh, I finished this last year, loved it, still live. Uh, I still prefer Super Metroid on the SNES though. Yeah, Super Metroid man, that, that was such a classic. Uh, but this is just as good uh, in my opinion man, just as good. Uh, I really hope Nintendo adds uh, GBA games to the Switch. Man, Aaron, I have been asking for that for so long. It would make so much sense. Imagine having Advance Wars, you know, this. So many good games released on the Game Boy Advance. It would make so much sense to put it on the uh, Nintendo Online service. But you know what Nintendo are like, man? They're so... They're really archaic in their approach to everything they do, really. Um, but yeah, I totally agree, man. Game Boy Advance on the online service would be incredible. Uh, welcome to the stream, by the way, dude. Dude, Golden Sun. Dan, I'm with you, man. 100% dude, I'm with you. Golden Sun is a classic. Did you ever play the other uh, Golden Suns in the series, Dan? What did you think of those? They were quite divisive, weren't they? Uh, the Mummy game looks like the perfect pixel art for the Switch. Alright, Paolo, I'll have to check that out, man. Yeah, definitely Kitsune. Super Metroid is incredible. One of the greats, man. Right now, guys, let's make it to there. Nice, we can get through some of the doors now. Right, so let's bring up our map. So we've got to go right up. Yeah, we should be good, lads. Right, let's do this. Uh, hey, what, what's Kaneta? <laughs> I like that name, man. Uh, welcome to the stream, dude. Uh, this or Zero Mission? Uh, I prefer this one, man, to be honest. Uh, Zero Mission was a, a remake, if I remember rightly, wasn't it? Oh, God! Got him, lads. As of now, I heard a leak that Nintendo are going to do a compilation of Pokemon games, early versions for Switch. I say, like, I think that would be cool, man, but I, I think it would be much better suited just to go straight onto the online service. It would make, you know, it would make the service a lot more robust if uh, the original Pokemon games were on there as well. But having to pay for them again separately, I, I'm not so sure about that, man. Right, so, is there anything down here we can find? Oh god! Nice. Oh shit, man. Is that guy dead? Man, everyone press F in the chat, man. <laughs> Let's pay our respects. Is that, is that even a dude? I think it is a guy. Oh shit. Sad times, man. Nah, no luck. Uh, this game looks great. Yeah, Ze uh, Xeophobic is it's incredible, man. It's one of the greats. One of the best games on the uh, Game Boy Advance, in my opinion. Along with Advance Wars, you know, Golden Sun. Loads of different games on the Game Boy Advance. I'd have to say the Game Boy Advance was probably my favourite handheld growing up. I first started off with a Game Boy and then Game Boy Color. Uh, but when I got to Game Boy Advance, man, it was just a whole different level. Like, you know, having like a pocket-sized Super Nintendo in your pocket. It was just... It was insane, man. Uh, dead guy on the floor and you're just teabagging him. <laughs> I know, right? What can I say? <laughs> I'm a sick individual. <laughs> uh, Griff, probably wait a year or two before I get a PS5. Uh, yeah, I, I was kind of lucky enough. Um, I was lucky enough to get my pre-order through, man. Um, so... It got confirmed the other day from Shock 2 as well. So I, I was one of the lucky ones to be able to get a pre-order. Um, the only game worth getting on launch is going to be Demon Souls, to be fair, though. Um, I'm not even sure what it's really launching with, to be honest. I've, I've hoped that Ratchet & Clank would have been a uh, launch title. Uh, but unfortunately, that's not going to be. What's this, man? Is this like a vending machine or something? <laughs> Right, let's just have a look. Let's search around, guys. Nope, we can't go that way anyway. Uh, Mind Waves, how you doing, dude? Oh, shit. Teach me to read the chat. How you doing, Mind Waves? Nice to catch you live, dude. 
Uh, Final Fantasy Tactics is still my favorite. Yeah, dude, Final Fantasy Tactics on the GBA was great. Um, I did play a lot of it on the uh, PSP though, um, but I did play the Game Boy Advance version, and it was it was pretty decent. Uh, but I spent a lot of time with the PSP version. Uh, <laughs> now he don't need his PS4 back. I <laughs> know, yeah, it's still around your house, isn't it? Then? Jesus. It'll be alright, the PlayStation 5 is like backwards compatible with most games. So you, you can just keep the PS4 uh, whilst lockdown is in place. Speaking of lockdown, guys, I hope everyone is staying safe in this uh, current difficult time. Uh, same with the PS5, although Demon's Souls is tempting. Yeah, dude, Demon's Souls looks incredible. That gameplay that they released um, on the latest PS5 event was just insane. Literally out of this world, man. Right, our objective is through here. National Lockdown 2 is on its way. Yeah, I can see it happening, right? I think it's the best thing, to be honest, man. Go through here, lads. Data room. Oh, is this where we got an upgrade? Nice, we got some rockets. Sweet. Oh, that's shine, man. So good. Uh, Resident Evil Village. I'm all over that. Yeah, dude. Resident Evil Village looks great. It does look incredible. Right, guys, tonight's stream is sponsored by the good folks over at Guinness. They were nice enough to uh, send a few bottles over, so here's the Guinness. Uh, I heard that Bloodborne Remastered will be available too. Yeah, dude, that'd be incredible. Uh, Bloodborne had a few uh, frame rate issues, didn't it? So it'd be nice to see that game fully realized the way they wanted it to be. Because, yeah, it was 30 frames per second, wasn't it? Uh, James is an alcoholic, in case no one noticed. <laughs> I don't know about that, dude. I just like having a, having a little drink with all you lads whilst we play a nice little game. Uh, Bloodborne was sick. I loved it. Yeah, Bloodborne was incredible. Really challenging, but really good, man. What about Sekiro, guys? Did you like that? Sekiro was good. Or Sarako, Sekiro. Uh, there's an upcoming Resident Evil 3D episodes to be aired in, on Netflix. Oh, is there? Oh, cool, man. I see. I don't mind the uh, the 3D Resident Evil films. Some of them are okay. They're a lot better than the live action films. Some of those are just so bad to watch, man. Right. Oh, can we go down here? Right, let's see what's in here. Recharge room. Nice. Right. Let's save up, guys. Um, I don't think you could be an alcoholic when you drink copper bits. <laughs> Dude, I haven't had a copper bit for years, man. I'm only drinking. Uh, I'm only drinking Guinness now. The stream sponsored by Guinness, so gotta give him a shout out. <laughs> Uh, love Sakura. Yeah, Sakura was incredible, man. How do we go down? Hmm. Oh, how do we get down, guys? Can we go back down? I don't think we can. Uh, hey, the Kaleido Kid. Uh, hey, this is awkward, but my main account doesn't appear in chat. I've only ever left positive comments on the channel. I don't know what's up. Ah, oh, dude, I'm not quite sure, to be honest. Um, yeah, that's really strange. I mean, if you can comment on the live streams, uh, you should be able to uh, leave comments on the videos. I'll, uh, I'll, look, in, I'll look into it for you, man. Uh, they already revealed uh, the trailer, sir. I thought it was his game, but it's not. Alright, cheers, sir. You'll have to check that out, man. Oh, 
god. What do we do here? I don't want to waste all these, man. Oh, nice. Hey, there we are, guys. Nice. Man, this exploration. Nice. Making progress. Uh, what's with the space after the apostrophe? Uh, what do you mean, man? Uh, TVGS gave the ban hammer. <laughs> I don't think I did, man. <laughs> you must have laughed at the Sonic 2 gameplay. <laughs> uh, what's your main account, sorry? Uh, it's called Jake Randall. Um, Alright, dude, I'll look into that. Um, I'm not sure, to be honest. You should still be able to uh, comment. Unless the comment system has like, flagged one of your comments. It's so sensitive, man, these days on YouTube. Uh, but yeah, I'll definitely look into it if you do. Uh, Zeophobic, is this emulation, buddy? Uh, yeah, it is, man. We are playing on the Visual Boy Advance. Uh, thanks, man. Absolutely love the content. Uh, cheers, Kaleido Kid. I really appreciate that, dude. Uh, we've got a top 10 coming out on Thursday, guys. Oh, shit. So, look forward to that. Oh, my God! Shit! We're going to be talking about... Uh... Oh, God. We're going to be talking about 10 underrated Switch games. So, uh, have a look for that. Oh my god. Can you, like, definitively kill these guys? No, we can't, can we? Oh, we got to catch those, haven't we? Here we are, we got it. Ah, he keeps on giving life back to him, doesn't he? Oh, come on, that's shine, man. That's bullshit. What? What is going on? Did we just use our blaster? No, we don't. Why can't we attack him? We hit him once, man, so... Nice, there we are. It's just because we're missing it. Oh god. Nice, I think we got it. Nice, we got it. Uh, thanks. Uh, pay for the channel for RAM info. <laughs> Cheers, man. Yeah, I'd like to uh, suggest as many games as I can for you guys. But yeah, we're going to be talking about some underrated Nintendo Switch games on Thursday. So look forward to that video. Energy tank, nice. Holy shit! Oh god! Fucking hell! <laughs> Holy shit! Oh god. Oh god, did we die? Oh Jesus, man! <laughs> oh fucking hell! Game over. <laughs> Stream's over, lads. Thanks for watching. <laughs> right. Let's try again. Oh god, thank god we saved. Right, so let's figure this out. Um, watching this on a fairly big screen, it looks really clean. Love the quality. Uh, yeah, man. Uh, what we're doing, we are rendering this. I think it's in like three times the resolution. <laughs> yeah, Lennox, man, that, <laughs> that was terrible, wasn't it? <laughs> I thought you were serious then. <laughs> 
Nah, we're okay, guys. We'll get through it. I haven't played this in so long. Get used to everything again. Nice. Some more missiles. Oh, I tell you what, what's that way? Or is there nothing that way? No, it looks like nothing. Uh, I walked in the stream just to watch him die. <laughs> That's just typical, isn't it? Right, so here we are. Oh shit. Right then guys, let's try this again. <laughs> That's the only reason I watch it. <laughs> Cheers, right. Um Oh, there's a secret in that empty room, is the uh Ah oh, shit, we can't get back, can we? Bollocks. Tell you what, let's save here. Do a quick save. Hey Fernando, welcome to the stream, man. Thanks for joining us, dude. Yeah, this game is really good, man. I've not played it in so long, though, so <laughs> I apologize for the bad gameplay at the moment. Right. Ah, shit. Oh, come on, I jumped. Ah, oh, guys. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Let's go again. Uh, I think there's a uh, missile upgrade or an energy tank. Oh, shit, man, we can't get back to it. Uh, maybe if I don't make it through this bit now, uh, we could try again. Jesus. We 
We're getting it, lads. We're getting it. Yes! Hold on! Oh my god. What is going on? <laughs> Oh God! Jesus! Nice. We finally got it, boys. We finally got it. Thank God. Right. Uh, morph ability recovered. Nice. So we can go into a ball now. It's about fucking time hammers, wasn't it? Jesus Christ. <laughs> uh, you're being chased by the... <laughs> Don't say that right. <laughs> We're going to trouble with that, mate. Nice. So we got this ability now, which should make things a bit easier for us. I'll tell you what. We need to, we need to fucking save, don't we? So uh, let's save right now. Just to be safe. Uh, hey, yummy, how you doing? Welcome to the streamer. Uh, where are you located? In the UK, dude. Oh god. Nice. Oh god! Shit! Uh, say, by the way, if you can fit a quick save and quick load on your control for easy quick button. Oh, true, save, hit sharp, man. Have to set that up. Oh, we're back here, are we guys? Oh, okay. Right, so. What's our objective now then? Uh, mobile ability absorbed. Proceed to navigation room. Alright, sweet, let's go to the navigation room. Uh, don't press load by accident. I've done. <laughs> yeah, true. Yeah, no, my life. That would happen. Would not be a good shot. Right, let's save in the game as well. Uh, your recommendations are different uh, from my friend's recommendations. Oh, cheers, Yummy. I try to recommend a good diverse uh, set of games. Uh, Lennox, what emulator is this anyway? Uh, we're playing on the Visual Boy Advance, man. Uh, it's running on Windows. Really good emulator, man. Uh, if you haven't already, guys, please do hit like. This helps up. Uh, on my ras Raspberry Pi, uh, selecting R1 is save. And selecting R1 is load. True, that would probably be a better option, having two buttons. I might have to try and set that up uh, before we stream again, man. It would make more sense. The objective is clear, lads. I can't wait to get the uh, uh, the little bombs that you get with the morph wall, man. That's going to be the one. Right, so it looks like we have to go this way. Uh, I'm going to mod my PlayStation Vita soon and play my games live. Dude, yes. All about modding the PlayStation Vita. One of the best handhelds to mod, man. One of the greats. Man, can we even get up there? Right, let's have a little check. We should be up to. Nice, there we are. We can morph ball through. Sweet. Nice. Progress is being made, lads. Yeah, the PlayStation Vita is so much better once you mod it, man. Such a great machine. Holy shit! Oh shit. Here we are, guys. Shit just got real. 
Uh, and I'm expecting my PlayStation TV. Is that a better choice to do a live stream? Yeah, it'd probably be a lot easier to stream from your PlayStation TV than a Vita. Because uh, when you do mod the PlayStation Vita, you can get the option, uh, one of the hacks on the system. You can actually stream your gameplay and sound to a uh, computer. And then obviously you'd just be able to capture that and stream. Uh, but I think it'd be a lot easier just to do it off the PlayStation TV, to be honest, man. Right, where is... Right, so this is the one we need to go down. I'll tell you what, guys, give me a second. I'm just going to have a quick break. Be right back. Right, sorry about that guys. Nature was calling. Right, so let us carry on with this. Uh, that would be easier, sir, uh, for next Final Fantasy 6 stream. Uh, shoulder buttons for quick. Yeah, it'd be a good shot. I'll set that up, say. Uh, yeah, guys, if you don't know, uh, we are streaming twice a week now, uh, every Wednesday and every Sunday. Uh, Wednesday is going to be a random game, uh, and Sunday we're going to be doing a continuous playthrough. And the game we're playing at the moment is Final Fantasy XVI. Uh, so look forward to that on Sunday as well, part two. If you haven't seen part one yet, it is up on the channel. Um, I don't know what random game we're going to be playing next week. Uh, so if there's any suggestions on any games that you would like me to play, uh, just drop them in the chat and we will put out a poll and whichever wins will be the one we play. <laughs> oh, but did I say 16? Yeah, we're not playing 16. We're playing 6. <laughs> I wish we were playing 16. But yeah, we're going to be playing Final Fantasy 6, not 16. <laughs> Exclusive preview. That'd be the one, man. Sorry, guys. I got Final Fantasy 16 on the mind, man. That game looks insane. Uh, hey, John. Welcome to the stream, dude. Thanks for joining us, man. Are you watching at work, are you? Where are you working, dude? Uh, you got the preview copy on PS5. <laughs> I got it on PS4, man. <laughs> Jesus. Slip of the tongue, lad. Slip of the tongue. Let it go. Let it go. Right, so, I've got to clear all five atmospheric stabilizers to stop them. Uh, I suppose. Our oh, an insurance company, is it? Ah, shit, John. Well, I'm glad I can provide you a bit of entertainment to get you through your day, man. Have you ever played this game before, John? Uh, I'm right there with you for Final Fantasy 16. It looks so... Uh, damn good. Man, totally agree, Paolo. I'm so glad that they're going back to a more like medieval approach uh, to the Final Fantasy game as well. Because we haven't really had a good medieval Final Fantasy for ages, man. Um, I played Zero Mission, but not Fusion. Uh, see, I, I much prefer uh, Fusion, uh, John. I, play, I used to play this a lot when I was young. Um, so that, I'm probably just a bit biased when it comes to it. Um, but yeah, I've got so many fond memories of this game. 
absolutely incredible game. I can't wait for Metroid Prime 4, man. It's going to be interesting to see what that's going to be like. Oh, God. Right, so we can't get through that way. Maybe if we jump down here. There we are. Nice. Oh, God! No! Fuck off! Leave me alone! <laughs> Jesus! Oh. Fuck off! <laughs> nice. Got through it eventually. Uh, when it comes out in 2025. <laughs> yeah. It's strange that we haven't heard anything about Metroid Prime uh, 4, man. It's very strange. They're really silent on that game at the moment. I hope we hear something about it uh, before the end of the year. Nice, so those are the stabilizers we need to take out, and there is four remaining. So, let us continue through. Oh god, there's a bunch of lads down here. Right, there we are, we got- OH GOD! Come on! Right, so these guys take the rockets. Oh god! Uh, the Switch is the best console Nintendo has offered, but why are they not releasing Game Boy Advance games? Dude, I'm not being funny. If Nintendo put Game Boy Advance games onto the Nintendo online service, that would just be incredible. And it, it's a no-brainer as well, man. Like, I, I guarantee, guarantee you a lot of people would sign up for the service just to be able to play Game Boy Advance games on the Switch. You know, games like uh, Advance Wars, Metroid Fusion, for example, Final Fantasy Tactics. This just unlimited choice when oh my god, why can't I get back through there now? There's just unlimited choice man. But yeah, I'm surprised they haven't already got them on there. What I would love is to see GameCube games on the Nintendo Switch. Especially uh Wind Waker. I'm surprised we haven't got a release of Wind Waker HD. That would be a nice inclusion. Right, can we actually progress in this room? Or have we just fucked ourselves? Oh god, I think we've just fucked ourselves. Can we got through some of these here? There it is. Oh god. Shit. Oh, come on. We should be able to go through there quickly in the ball. Nice. Nice. We got three remaining. Can we get back out this door now? Nice. Uh, people would appreciate re-releases. Yeah, totally, man. I would plan, like, obviously expecting GameCube games on the Switch Online service might be a bit too much to ask for. Um, but yeah, I would gladly pay for a re-release, man. Progress. Oh god. We're doing good, guys. Uh, yummy. Maybe before uh, they will release Breath of the Wild 2, Nintendo will drop uh, release the HD remastered version of Wind Waker, Twilight Princess, and Skyward Sword. I could see that happening, man, because the, uh, the anniversary uh, for Zelda is coming up soon. So we could probably expect something like, oh my god, we we'll probably expect something like they did for um, uh, Super Mario, which would be cool, man. 
I'd love to see it. Oh god. Oh god. But yeah, that would, that would make a nice uh, Zelda collection. You know, Twilight Princess, Skyward Sword, and Wind Waker HD. Right, that looks like a bad idea. Let's not go in there. Uh, if you haven't already, guys, please do leave a like. It does help us out. Oh god, we're dropping. Shit, son. How many of these things are there? Um, imagine a remake of this game in Zero Mission. Dude, that'd be incredible. I'd love to see another 2D uh, Metroid, man. That would be so cool to see. I just hope uh, Metroid Prime is going to live up uh, to the expectations people have of it. With uh, Retro working on it. Should be fine. Right, we've got two units left. Oh god. Nice, we dealt with them boys. Alright, so where have we got to go? Oh, we just got to keep on searching. Alright, so let's keep on looking. Um, I would pay an extra 10 to 20 bucks a year for Nintendo Online if they added N64 and GameCube games. Yeah, I totally agree, man. I'm surprised they haven't done something like that. I mean, it would be so easy to implement. Right, one of those things are in here. Right, it's in the background, we're okay. Right, we have to jump up over here. But yeah, seeing uh, N64 and GameCube games on the Switch would be incredible, man. What is that? Right. Jesus. Nice. What games would uh, everyone want uh, from the GameCube and N64 if they were to do it? Oh, dude, yeah. Game Boy, uh, Game Boy Advance Classic. That'd be awesome. I'd pick one up in a half heat, man. Right, is there any, like... Oh my god. Nah, we're okay. Right, we need to get some more missiles, man. Hey, there we are. Dude, Goldeneye. Yes, that'd be incredible, man. I'd love to see a Goldeneye on the Switch. Uh, Paper Mario, The Thousand Year Door. <laughs> Yo, Beautiful Joe. Nice, man. Nice selection. And Killer 7. Cool, man. Nice selection instead, man. Fate and Kytos, yeah, definitely. That's one head of an RPG, man. One of the greats. Right, so. Oh, we didn't go in that room, did we? I suppose it'd be good to go and see what's in there. Hey Richard, how you doing man? Thanks for joining us dude. Uh, I enjoyed the Fire Emblem stream. Cheers man. Like I said, if there's... Uh... Oh god, we can't get in there, can we? Right. Like I said, if there's uh, any games that you want me to stream next week, uh, just let me know some suggestions and I'll put them in the poll. Oh god. Nice. Uh, Rhino, you know my choice. Dude, I'm not playing fucking Hell Knight, <laughs> okay? Hell Knight is lame. Just stop suggesting it, please. <laughs> I'm not doing it. <laughs> uh, any movies you're looking forward to? 
Uh, yeah, dude, I wanted to go and watch Tenet. Um, but obviously, with the situation with, uh, you know, the current state of the world, um, obviously I couldn't, man. Um, so I'm just waiting for that to come out. Hey, Rescue, how you doing, man? Welcome to the stream, dude. Uh, got to get ready for work. Oh, no worries, Rescue. Hope you have a good day, mate. Oh, God. Have a good day, dude. Hope work goes very quick for you. Uh, yeah, we could stream some PlayStation 1 games, man. I managed to get the emulator set up and working, so... Uh, yum, yum, yum. What about your RPG collections? Uh, what do you mean, man? You want me to play an RPG? Uh, I suppose we could do. Um, but we're currently doing a full playthrough of Final Fantasy VI. So uh, we could leave one of the- oh my god, if I just fucked myself. I fucked myself, haven't I? Like, uh, for Wednesday's games, I think, uh, you know, pick up and play games would probably be the better choice. Something that we can enjoy all enjoy really quickly. Yeah, I think this is a dead end, say. So. Uh, please do a top 10 horror games list for Halloween. Uh, yeah, Carl, man, I'm going to be doing that. Uh, funny enough, um, I made the list last year, but I didn't get around to releasing it. So uh, I've, I've literally got the list on my computer ready to upload. Um, I'll, I'll obviously do a bit of uh, editing to the video, because the way I make videos are a bit different to how I used to do them then. Um, but yeah, I've already got my top 10, man. Definitely gonna do so. I might do like Halloween special stream as well. I think that'd be a laugh, man. Right, guys, I think we're stuck. Like, genuinely. <laughs> number one is Hell Knight. No, number one is not Hell Knight, right? It's not even in the top 10, man. I'll give you a hint Silent Hill 2 is in the top 10. Right, guys, I'm not sure if we're just in a dead end. And if we are, I, I don't know what the hell we're going to do. I mean, we could always try and uh, always reload. Oh god, no. <laughs> in costume, yeah, I'd be up for that, John. Uh, blast the ground. Good shot, man. Ooh, true, we might... Might be away there. Richard, I think you're onto something. I think I might be here. Yes! Richard, you are the man. I don't know what I dress up as, guys. Who, sh who should I dress up as for Halloween? For the Halloween stream. <laughs> oh god. Oh, come on. No. Shit. Nice. <laughs> Joe Biden. <laughs> oh, John, I can't dress up as Joe Biden, man. Jesus. Uh, what are your thoughts on the Silent Hill franchise in general? Favorites and least favorites. Uh, Silent Hill 2 is the best for me, man. Uh, Silent Hill 1. And then anything after that is kind of just downhill. Uh, Silent Hill uh, 3 was good, man. Um, but yeah. Everything else after that wasn't my cup of tea. How about you, Ray? Uh, dress up as the video game show. <laughs> I'll figure something to dress up as, guys. Right, let's save here. Save complete. 
Nice. Oh, shit. Did not expect them to be there. Ah, oh, true. It generates all the enemies when you leave. Oh, no. Not this one. Here we are. Oh, God. Is this a boss battle? Oh, no. <laughs> Dress up as Batman. Oh, God. It's a fucking boss battle. Oh, we're saving. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, guys, we're fucked. Jesus. Right, so what are the options? What options do we have here? Do we just shoot the shit out of it, or...? Um, are there any famous people from the UK named Joe? I can only think of Joe Cocker. <laughs> Dude, I've never heard of Joe Cocker. Ah, shit, man. Oh shit. Uh, shooting with the missiles. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> Richard. <laughs> I can't dress up as anyone political, man. <laughs> I don't think that would go down too well. Uh, and the red eye. Alright, cheers, Carlos. Thanks for joining us as well, Carlos. Oh god. Shit! Shit! Oh Jesus, why isn't the jump coming out? Oh god, oh god! Nice! Oh shit, man. Alright, let's load. Jesus. Jesus Christ! Nice. We got him, guys. Well, guys, if you haven't already, please do leave a like. It does really help us out. Alright, so. We've got a charge blast now. Nice. That's really going to help us out. Cheers, Carlos. We got there in the end, guys. Right, let's save in game as well. Save complete. Right, let's keep on making our way through. Oh, God! Well, guys, we're at 36 likes. Let's get to 40. We can do it. I don't think we can get through here though. Um, ah, so we have to go back in that room and then up and across. By the looks of it. Nice. Uh, will you be watching the Batman or Justice, Justice League? Um, I'm probably going to check out the new Batman film. See what it's all about. 
Uh, how about you, Rich? Hey, nice area. So I think this might be the last one, lads. Uh, but yeah, I'm pretty excited to see how the new Batman film turns out. I'm not sure about the actor they chose at the moment. Um, but it'll be interesting to see nonetheless. Uh, who's your favorite Batman? Oh, dude, probably Michael Keaton, man. Old school Batman. Um, I really like, um, oh, for fuck's sake, what's his name now? Christian Bale. Really like Christian Bale's Batman. Um, but yeah, it's probably gonna have to be Michael Keaton for me, man. How about you, Ray? Alright, so we've got that one done, lads. Oh, Clooney is meant to be coming back. See, I've seen articles that are saying uh, Keaton is coming back, man. George Clooney was alright, man, but... I don't know, man. I didn't really like those Batman films. The one, which one was he in? The one was he the was he in the one with Mister Freeze? I was not really a fan of that one, man. Uh, definitely gonna watch both. Uh, Patterson is the best actor alive, and Zack Snyder's Justice League, Justice League will be fucking amazing. True, they're releasing uh, like the new cut of it, aren't they? Uh, Michael Keaton is it Batman Forever? Uh, yeah, I think that's the one. The one with uh, the Penguin. I think that's it. Uh, the Boys is good on Amazon Prime. See, I, man, I still haven't watched that. I might have to check that out, man. Still haven't got around to it. Um, I like Annie, so I always watch, watch it for the pants. <laughs> right, where do we need to get to now? Right, we need to get to a navigation room. So, we should be able to make our way across here. Yeah, Batman Returns, that's the one, man. Oh god. Not Batman Forever, my bad. It's been so long since I've watched them, man. Oh, can we get through here now? Nice. Oh, Kilmer, that's it, man. What did you guys think of uh, the Joker film? Have you seen the Joker film? With uh, Wacky and Phoenix? Now oh, that's a great film. I thought that was incredible. I went to go uh, watch that with Amy, man. Such a good film. Uh, it was okay, it kind of reminded me of Taxi Driver. <laughs> Rhino, how do you feel about nipples on bat suits? <laughs> Dude, I'm against nipples on bat suits. Let me just say that right now, lads. I'm against nipples. Should not be a thing. <laughs> what is it like nipples on the bat uh, on the newest Batman film or something? <laughs> nipples on bat suits are amazing. Such an ingenious design. <laughs> Bat nipple laser cannons. Now that is a power I can get behind. <laughs> yeah, John, I agree, man. I wouldn't mind on Catwoman's, but on Batman, no. <laughs> Not in my books. Uh, I think Clooney had bat nips. <laughs> bat nips. <laughs> That's what they're going to be called from now on, is it? The bat nips. Uh, the tropical habitat. Alright, sweet. <laughs> it is clear. Alright, so. We need to go back up here. And uh, go back down one of the elevators. Uh, we haven't been to the cinema since The Rise of Skywalker. Bad times. Yes, bad times indeed. The Rise of Skywalker was terrible. 
literally felt like hanging myself after watching that fucking train wreck, man. Jesus. The sequel trilogy, like, what did they do? What were they thinking of? Completely ruined fucking Star Wars, man. It's terrible. <laughs> it was funny, Aim. I was literally just shouting in the cinema whilst we were watching it. <laughs> I was like, what is this shit? I'm surprised you didn't want to leave, to be honest, Aim. Right. Yeah, I totally agree, John. They just ruined it, man. The Force Awakens was a good setup, even though it was basically a new hope told over again. Um, but, you know, it was a good setup. And then The Last Jedi just pissed all over it, man. Uh, at least Rise isn't Last of Us 2. <laughs> You've got a point there, Rich. Last of Us 2 was just as bad. Yeah, John, well, uh... What's her name? Daisy, Daisy Ridley, the lady who played Rey. Um, she recently came out and admitted that they didn't have a plan. It's insane. I mean, that's like the one thing you'd think they'd need. Yeah, they just winged it, yeah. And they winged it bad. Totally bad, man. What I would have liked to have seen is uh, Snoke uh, being Darth Plagueis. Uh, Palpatine's master that he mentions in... Oh, which one does he mention in the now? I think it's Re Revenge of the Sith. Uh, but yeah, Darth Plagueis would have been awesome. Because he was the one who learned how to cheat death. That would, man, that would have brought the whole... like That would have brought all nine films for full circle. Would have been incredible. But no, instead, they wanted to resurrect Palpatine. It's, oh, I can't believe that when they resurrected pa Oh my god. <laughs> At the beginning of the film, like, it's just insane. Like, he should not be there. It's like, you died, mate. Uh, I wanted Jar Jar to be a Sith Lord. Dude, Jar Jar is the real issue. He was the real baddie. He was the one who gave uh, the powers to Palpatine, wasn't he? So yeah, when you think about it, it's all Jar Jar's fault. Little prick. <laughs> uh, Last of Us 2, Last Jedi, and Justice League. Are the unholy trinity of suffering. <laughs> yeah, I totally agree, man. Last of Us Two is a train wreck. I think the problem in is, I think the like the main issue is there's just a lot of agendas these days, and it's just being pumped into everything, every facet of media. It's all you see, and unfortunately, it's just ruining like all of these stories that we were brought up on. You know, like what they did to Luke Skywalker is it's fucking unforgivable, man. Unforgivable. That character was about hope, and they just turned him into some fucking idiot, like, you know what I mean? Save complete. Right, better stop talking about Star Wars and agendas, guys. The stream is going to get shut down. You know what YouTube's like these days, Jesus. Right. Holy moly, what the fuck is that? Right, I think... Yeah, I think that is blocked off to us. Don't think we can go that way, lads. Right, so... Right, the target is there. Let's see if we can do a bit of exploration. Before we go to the target. Oh my god. Hey, the one guy, how you doing, man? Welcome to the stream, dude. Uh, you can read the screenplay for Justice League online for free. It was supposed to be directed by George Miller. Yo, George Miller! The Mad Max guy! That, man, that would have been incredible. He's such a good director. I think the good thing about Star Wars, uh, what's his name? Is it Colin Trevorrow? Trevorrow? The guy who did Iron Man? Uh, have you heard his version? of uh, episode 9, Jewel of the Fates. That is so much better than what we've got uh, with Rise of Skywalker. If you haven't checked that out guys, you, you can read that script online as well. Um, it's a really good read. Totally recommend it. Uh, 
uh, Luke should have become the new Emperor and be more evil than Palpatine because he left his training and let his need for revenge dominate his destiny. That would have been a cool play on the story. I could have got behind that. It's a lot better than him just becoming some fucking muppet who just gives up on everything, you know what I mean? At least that would have been something with a bit of nuance. But yeah, he just becomes a man-child. It's just stupid. And Ray is just a joke. She's like a fucking... She's like an aimbot, man. <laughs> she just gets everything right. Never misses. Never gets defeated. It's like she just got cheats on. It's terrible. Security room. Anything in here? Oh my god, what is that? Is it gonna fuck us? That's what I need to know. Is it gonna fuck us? Oh no. Brie Larson said she wants to play Samus in a Metroid movie. Well, Brie Larson can go fuck off. The last thing we need is her in a, <laughs> in a Metroid fucking movie. Jesus. Did you hear what she said? Was it at the Oscars or like the BAFTAs or whatever? What she said about like white males and stuff like that. Like the people in Hollywood are just so out of touch. They just create issues where there are no issues. It's just insane man. Uh, hey Omar, how you doing dude? Uh, wait a minute, this is a Mega Man. <laughs> no, this is Metroid Fusion dude. Uh, you can also read Superman Flyby, an old Superman movie that was supposed to be made by J.J. Abrams. <laughs> Spoilers, it's fucking terrible. Yeah. Yeah, guys, I'll stop. I'll stop talking about uh, all that shit. I'll get shut down. So, yeah. That's the last you hear about it from me. Right, so our target is done there. Oh my god! I think we need to get some more energy. Nice. <laughs> the lesson we need. No, we don't we don't need lesson. Nice. I got as much energy before we get to where we need to go. <laughs> Cheese theft. <laughs> yep. Uh, did you hear that they're announcing Samus for Smash Bros. tomorrow? Dude, she's already in it, isn't she? Pretty sure she's already in it, Omar. Come here! Nice. Oh, Dark Samus. Oh, cool, man. Nice. It'd be cool to see Dark Samus. Data room. Nice. Nice. We can finally drop bombs now. So, let's give it a go. Nice. That's going to really help us out, guys. Right, let's get back to our navigation room. <laughs> They're adding Doom Guy and Master Chief. I can't see that happening, man. Oh god, why can't we get out? Oh, we're just gonna have to do the bombs, aren't we? No? What the hell? Oh, there we are. Does this actually affect us? No, we're cool. <laughs> uh, Sakurai said he wanted James Bond on the original N64 Smash. Dude, that would have been fucking incredible, man. P.S. Brosnan in Super Smash Bros. I'd pay money for that. Uh, oh, you have no idea who they're announcing to Roma. Hopefully it's a third party character, man. That'd be nice to see. 
Because what was the last one they announced? It was Byleth, uh, wasn't it? From Fire Emblem. Oh god, I wanted to go that way. Alright. Uh, right. Oh, we needed to go to a navigation room, didn't we? Right, if we go up here, hopefully we'll be able to get up. That's uh, a save room, let's save up. Uh, yeah, John, th this game is quite tricky. I used to play, uh, play it a lot when I was a teenager, man. Um, but I haven't played it for quite some time. Uh, but going back to it, it's really good. I used to play this on the bus. On the way to high school, man. This and uh, Advance Wars. Those are the two games I played the most on the uh, Game Boy Advance. Right, so, don't know if I can even get up that way. Can we jump as the ball yet? Yeah. What? Come on. Oh yeah, it jumps you. It makes you jump, doesn't it? Nice, there we are. I remember now. <laughs> Smash Bros is the best fire weapon game. I don't know, man. Uh, Path of Radiance is my favorite. Uh, my favorite Fire Emblem game. Is if any of you played uh, Free Houses? Oh God! Oh God! Dakota, how you doing, man? Welcome to the stream, dude. Uh, Metroid has four, and three of them are Samus. What's that, man? The amount of characters in uh, uh, Smash. Uh, to one guy. Oh, what's that? Smash, dude. Ah, shit, man. Sorry to hear you lost your cartridge. That is never nice. Alright guys, I think we're going really, really deep. Why are you talking about uh, free houses, you the one guy? Yeah, free houses is great, man. I really like the uh, emphasis upon characters. Right, we need to find a navigation room, so I don't think we're going the right way, to be honest. And this is the only way we can progress now, though. Oh, god damn it! Leave me alone! Oh, don't tell me we're another dead end. The hell is that? Nice. Oh god. Nice, we got it, lads. Uh, are you in the UK? Uh, yeah, I'm in the UK, Rich. How about yourself, man? Where are you from? Sorry, guys. It's, it's really hard to focus on the chat and play this, man. It's, <laughs> it's really intense. It's a bit easier with Final Fantasy VI. A lot of laid back uh, compared to this. Uh, there's going to be part two of Final Fantasy VI as well on Sunday, uh, so keep an eye out for that. Oh God, why aren't you dying? <laughs> yeah. 
Yo! Shit, son! You got us! Nice, luckily we saved. Uh, we're in the same time zone, time zone then. Oh, you're in Germany right now, you do? Oh, cool. Alright, Rich, thanks for stopping by, man. Catch you soon. Uh, I'm excited for the continuation of F6. Yeah, dude, it's going to be great. It's been so much fun playing through that. Right, there we are. There's a way to get up there. So... Nice. Oh god! Right, so... Mm. Do we have to go around that long way? I think we're gonna have to. Jesus Christ! <laughs> James can't multitask. <laughs> So anyway, yeah, I think we're gonna have to go that long way, lads. Because that just leads. Well, that's just fucked. We can't go that way anyway, so. Yeah, looks like it's this way. Alright, that's just a save room, isn't it? Yeah. Alright guys, if you haven't, please do leave a like, it really helps us up, help us reach a wider audience. Right, so, let's make our way for this. Yeah, dude, getting lost in this is not a good idea, it's so big. Uh, but we just need to find uh, a navigation room. Should be able to find one. Just trying to make our way there, see? Oh god. Jesus. Jesus! There we are. Uh, I've never played a Metroid game. Well, you've never played a Metroid game with Roma. Jesus. Not even Super Metroid. Or Metroid Prime. They're really good games, man. Yeah, they can be quite tough. They're really good, though. Oh, you've dabbled with you. Which one did you play briefly? Oh my god, not these bastards. Leave me alone! Nice. Holy shit. Fuck off. Oh my god. Right. Right, that little blue bastard was down here, wasn't he? So... Be careful. Make sure he doesn't get us again. Right. How the hell are we meant to defeat this lad? Nice. Fine, you got him. Um. Hey, Noel, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Thanks for joining us, man. 
Uh, Metro games is so beautiful. Yeah, they're great. Especially the pixel art ones, man. It's such a beautiful game. Um, I've never beat a non-prime Metro game, to be honest. Oh, haven't you, John? Have you, which uh, ones of the old ones have you played then, John? Uh, I got like 10 minutes into Metro Prime uh, and a couple of stages into Super Metroid. Ah, okay, fair play, man. Hey, Skill, how you doing, man? Thanks for joining us, dude. How you been, man? Right, how are we gonna get up there? Jesus. Oh, yo. Oh, if I remember rightly. Oh, God. Oh, this is going to be tricky, guys. Bomb on the right side. Me too, man. Can't jump up there. <laughs> you joined this. <laughs> Place bomb on the ground. Yeah, you've got to do like. You've got to do like three of them, haven't you? Well, the right side, but not all the way. All right, man. <laughs> How the fuck? How are you meant to figure that out? That's insane, man. Dude, cheers, John. You're a legend. We would have been stuck there for, for days if you hadn't told me about that. I thought what you had to do is like write the like write the bombs. <laughs> Rage moments. Classic, classic TVGS moments, man. Probably oh, still haven't found a navigation room, have we, lads? Oh god! I can die! Man, we should be getting close to one, man. Looks like it's a lost cause. Let's jump back out of here. Um, I watched the new Terminator the other day. Oh man, it's meant to be pants, isn't it? Looks like we can't go that way. So let's try this one. Oh god. Nice. So we can't go through that way again. Let's, let's try this way. Nice save room. Hopefully we'll find a navigation here soon. <laughs> the Sonic, well, the Sonic movies are on DVD, is it? 
It's a fiver. <laughs> I still haven't seen it, man. Was it good? Nice. And as you can pass, you can priest. It can priest? Increased? Not sure where else we can go. Yeah, I totally agree, John. It's insane trying to make your way around it. Right, so it looks like we're gonna have to go left and then up. I still haven't seen it, Omar. Jim Carrey was really good in it, was he? I don't mind Jim Carrey, he's a good, good actor, man. What's everyone's favorite Jim Carrey movie? I can't get through there. Jesus. Right, maybe if we go outside, try going up this way. <laughs> Amy dropping those bombs, man. <laughs> yeah, I remember you saw it, Amy, didn't you? Oh, not this bastard! Go away! Nice. Alright, guys, maybe if we go up to here uh, and up to the right. Our eternal sunshine with the spotless mind. Great film, Skull. Uh, Bruce Almighty. Yeah, it's John. That's a great one. <laughs> John, Amy is right. <laughs> oh, guys, I think we're stuck again. Why are you doing this to me? Can't get out of here now. Yeah, Omar, I totally agree, man. The original design for Sonic was really strange one day. Something out of fucking nightmares. Right, maybe we're just gonna have to. Bombs on the ground and see if we can make make a different path. Oh, true. Yeah, there's an animated Mario movie soon as well, isn't there? I completely forgot about that, John. Oh, guys, we. Somebody's here, but there's... Look, we can't get through there. Jesus. I think we're stuck, lads. Right, let's try and... Nowhere opening up. <laughs> it came fast to the rescue. <laughs> I just have no idea where we're meant to go, man. We've got to get to the navigation room, but we just can't get out of here because when we go through this door here. It's just a fucking brick wall. No, can't get up there. Is there another one of those tower things to help you out? I'm not quite sure to be honest. I'll tell you what, we could go to that. Oh god. Where was that water area, man? Was that down here? 
Uh, is there another one of those tower things to have you like? Dude, I, I'm not sure. We're in the safe room. We go up there and we just, we just can't get through there. Try through this way again. And this just might be blocked off as well. Oh, you mean the bomb in the ramp? Uh, I'm not quite sure still. Uh, John, let us know about that, man. Here we go. Might be something in this room. That's where we found some rockets, but... Hey, nice. There we are. Redemption. Shit, son. God damn it! Let me fucking kill you! Nice. <laughs> oh shit. Alright, John. I hope the rest of your day goes good, man. Thanks for joining us, dude. Oh god, is this a boss fight? Oh god! Holy fucking moly! Holy shit! Right, so we're gonna have to put a rocket up in when he does that, aren't we? Hey John, thanks for the super chat, man. Really appreciate that, dude. I'll uh, catch you on Sunday for Final Fantasy VI, yeah? Hope your day goes good. Oh shit! Oh, come on. Right, do we have to put a rocket up there? Shit, son. Nine. Cheers, John. Stay safe, dude. Do we have to put bombs up there? Nope. <laughs> Rocket up his ass. <laughs> yeah, I think that's what we gotta do, man, but... Ah, I don't think it's working. Shit, sir. Maybe a powerful one. I'm gonna do a wait for him now. Ah, oh, shit, I thought that was gonna be it. Yes, it's the powerful one by the looks of it. Alright, so let's keep him charged. Shit, we missed. Bollocks! Nice. And smaller and smaller. It's working. Shit. Oh god! Yes! Right, I think this might be the last one. Hopefully. Oh god, he's going really fast now. <laughs> Giant purple condom. Yeah, man. You ain't half wrong, right? Oh god. Shit! Oh, did he fucking- No! Oh, 
shit, man. This is rough. <laughs> you got calmed down. <laughs> oh god. Right, we got this, lads. I think this might be the last hit. Go away, no! This might be the last hit and we should be okay. Ah, shit! I know for a fact, as soon as I go underneath him, he's just gonna come down on me. Nice, was that the last one? Shit! <laughs> he's shrinking to church's side. Where is church? Oh god! Right, guys, if you haven't already, please do leave a like. Let's help us out! <laughs> Let's get to 50 likes before we end the stream. Oh man, this is rough. Right, we'll get to this next time. Yes! We've done it, lads. Oh god, no, we haven't. Oh god, fuck, we're fucked. Oh god. Nice. We got it, guys. Nice, now we can do the jump ball. See, I always thought there was a mechanic that involved uh, jumping with the ball. So, good, good stuff. Nice. We should be able to get out of this place now, then. Ah, oh, God. Oh. oh, God. Are we going to get out of here now? Hey, say. Thanks, man. We did it. We got this. Oh, God. I'm not sure how we're going to do it, though. There we are, we can just jump, nice. True, we got extra high jump, haven't we? Nice. My bad. Nice, so we should be able to progress now, guys. We get to that navigation place. We should at least be able to get out. Right, let's give it a quick save. Should be able to get out of here. Oh god, not this guy. Jesus! I always fuck this man. Yo, how did that get destroyed? No. Holy shit, guys. Oh no. <laughs> shit just got real. Shit, man, that's so ominous, isn't it? Jesus. Right. Can we get down from here? Right, I think that needs to save. And be facing Dark Samus, boys. Oh, this could get rough. Is that an enemy? Oh, I thought that was an enemy. Alright, so... <clears throat> we should be able to jump up here. Go to that navigation room. Oh, 
Uh, no luck. Oh, we could shoot through there. Nice. Go away! Yo, those things are freaking me out, man. I don't like standing on those. Nice. Nearly at that navigation room. Where the hell did all these things come from? Oh, shit. See if we can go through that way. Oh god. Uh, best part of fusion, uh, right there. Chills the first time I saw it. Yeah, Paolo, totally agree, man. That bit was insane. <laughs> Looks so cool. Right now guys, we've been streaming for about two hours, so I'm going to call it in a couple of minutes. We'll just get to the navigation room. Quickly save up. This music is so good. Alright, the objective is clear. Alright, so we'll have to move on to the next navigation room. Uh, but we will leave that for another stream. So, thank you guys. Thanks for popping along and joining us whilst we played a bit of Metroid Fusion. Uh, we're going to be doing uh final fantasy 6 on sunday so make sure you drop by for that guys probably be around uh half seven uh maybe half seven seven ish you know around that time uh there'll be a poll out ooh, probably tonight or after tomorrow's video we're going to be talking about underrated nintendo switch games tomorrow so look out for that video uh, around 6 p.m but yeah guys Thanks for watching. It's been great. It's always nice tuning out with you lads. And it's always fun playing these retro games with you as well. Uh, right, cheers, Carl. Thanks for stopping by. Cheers, say. Glad you enjoyed it, man. I will catch you all tomorrow in tomorrow's video. And then see you again live on Sunday. So until then, take care and stay safe. All right, guys. Cheers to one guy. Catch you soon, lads.